CBS 12 meteorologist Michael Ehrenberg in the CBS 12 mobile storm tracker. Michael driving through Port St. Lucie. That looks like a tough afternoon. Yes, it certainly is, Chris. I just passed St. Lucie West about five minutes ago, and it was really coming down hard. Notice on the radar, we're right in the middle of the yellow and the orange, indicating torrential downpours with gusty winds. I'm actually approaching Fort Pierce. I just passed State Road 70. And if you notice, I've got the wipers on at a moderate speed. Uh, actually, everybody's slowed down now to about 60 miles an hour. The speed limit up here is 70, so that is good news. And front camera, back camera, just about everybody has their lights on. And earlier with those torrential downpour pours, the actual lights on the streets were on full blast as well. So I'm going to continue driving north, and I'll keep you posted throughout the newscast. Back to you. All right, drive safely. Thank you, Michael. Great. Michael is in the CBS 12 mobile storm tracker. Wow, Michael, tell us what's going on. That is unbelievable. Yeah, it is unbelievable, Chris. A uh, quick check of our app to the side here shows that I'm right in this worst band here with the oranges and reds. And the rain just got a lot worse in the last couple of minutes or so. I've slowed my speed down to about 45 to 50 miles an hour. A lot of water on the roadways, okay? So folks out driving, I mean, I would hope that they're going to pull over. We've got the street lights on above me. Uh, people have their headlights on coming both south to north and north to south. And like Chris was talking about, you know, this area is still under the tornado warning. The severe thunderstorm warning in effect for Palm Beach County because a lot of these storms are tracking from the uh, west-northwest down to the east-southeast. So a lot of these people on the roadways, Chris, I don't think they're aware that there's a tornado warning in effect, and they're just driving along thinking it's a heavy rainstorm. Uh, so again, a lot of unawareness up here, but I'm definitely aware of it. Uh, we've got a lot of lightning that's been flashing on and off. Uh, you heard Jan Eschbach, the winds have been gusting as well. And we see people just taking it very slow out here this afternoon. All right, perfect, Michael. And Again, you know what? that tornado warning in effect for at least the next five minutes or so. Yeah, perfect, Michael. You know, CBS 12 weather expert he is tracking the heaviest rain. And Michael, I have to tell you, I just saw a couplet velocity couplet which indicated the possibility of a rain wrapped tornado that just moved through the eastern part of Jupiter moving off the coast as we speak. What are you seeing in Jupiter? Well, it's very, very heavy rain out here right now, Jeff. I mean, it's just as bad, if not worse than it was when I was moving through Martin County. The speed on my car here is slowed down about 50 miles an hour. There's a lot of water on the roadways right now and people are really taking it slow. Everybody's got their headlights on, and I am looking off and into the clouds. There's a lot of rain, obviously, so it's, it's hard to see if there is a funnel cloud or a tornado. But, I mean, I wouldn't doubt it because just the amount of lightning is just unbelievable right now. On my 995 going south, so if I look off to the east, it does look darker, okay? Uh, I look off to the west um, a little bit lighter. So I think I'm in the worst of this weather. And this has moved in. I've been tracking it on our weather app over here. It's moved in from west to east, from a stream northern Palm Beach County towards the east. And of course, uh, just a blinding rain right now. So people are really taking it slow. It's tough. And because of the obscuring of the sky due to the rain, I, I can't see up into the clouds too much. But it could mean that there is some kind of funnel cloud up there or a tornado right now. We're going to continue to drive south. And eventually, we will be moving into more rain. I'm looking at our app over here, and it just seems to be <coughs> filling in on the radar. Yeah. Frequent lightning, a lot of thunder at the present time. Very, very rough driving. And I've got both hands, as you can see, in the steering uh, uh, right, wheel right yeah, now. Yeah, be careful, Michael. Definitely take it slow. You are actually driving into what is probably the heaviest of the rain, which is now redeveloping, as you can see on Michael's radar right there. But take people through what you've been doing for about the past hour or so uh, and tell them uh, how bad the storms have been and what it's looking like right now. Well, I drove south, Jeff, from uh, Port St. Lucie and Stewart about an hour ago down through Hope Sound and the Palm City area. That's where the weather was the worst. We had numerous uh, spin outs on the highways. There was ponding of water on the roadways, a lot of lightning. And then there's a little bit of a break in southern Martin County, and then the rain really began to pick up again as I entered the Jupiter area in Juneau. So I got off at the Donald Ross Road, and have now moved east towards the beach, and I'm going back towards the north again. And uh, let me tell you something, the palm trees have really been whipping around here. I, I would say winds are gusting past 40 miles an hour. Okay, uh, there's still a lot of water on the road here. I'm right along that beach road between the Juno Beach Pier and Carlin Park in Jupiter. And people are taking it slow. Whenever you go through some of these puddles, the water splashes up on your windshield and you temporarily get blinded. So uh, definitely a rough trip. 
down from the Treasure Coast this afternoon. Great. But in this CBS 12 mobile storm tracker, he's headed in that direction. Right yes, Michael, where are you exactly right now? I'm actually in Martin County right now, Chris, dropping along I-95 South. And I got to tell you, the rain is coming down in sheets. There's ponding of water on the roadway right now. In fact, I've had to slow my speed down under 50 miles an hour. Uh, people are behind me, people in front of me going from south to north also have their headlights on. And like you've been talking about, uh, there's been a lot of lightning out here. The clouds are very low hanging. There's a lightning strike right now. I just saw it. And about five minutes or so ago, a little north of here, there was a car that spun out in front of me. And I think it's because he was going too fast. Uh, he was hydroplaning on the roadway. It spun around and around. Fortunately, it got off the road and backed okay. off Michael, just as I went by him. Michael